Okay guys, so this is a simple video that um, a lot of people probably have already made this video, I don't know. I'm just, I have to do it for this laptop, so I figured I'd make the video. Uh, what it is, is just a free, how to still do a free upgrade from Windows 7 to Windows 10. Um, I'm going to just put the link in the description below so make it easier for you guys. But for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it, like, I'm going to do it fully right now. Um, so you just type in Windows Assistive Technology on Google Chrome. Um, I know there's probably lots of videos about this, I don't know, I just, I had to do it for this laptop, so I figured why not put it on here. Um, and then just, yeah, go on to any of these links that will take you here. I'm just trying to find it here. Um, once, but for me, I'm just going to leave the link for you guys, and that will make it very simple. You know when you want to do it, it will be there. Um, There it is. Okay, so I'm gonna leave you the link directly to this. Okay, so as long as your Windows 7 is legit, it'll definitely it'll do the upgrade for you. All you click on is um, so I'll literally save this link down in the description below. You just click on upgrade now. Um, it'll download it here in the corner, and then so you just you know you open it when it's finished to download. And then you'll be prompted with this page here, uh, upgrade to Windows 10. Just say accept. Then it's checking everything here. You say next. And now it's going to do the download for you. I'm not going to record the whole thing, but when the download does take approximately, it depends on your internet speed, right? So it could be about an hour, 30 minutes, maybe less. Um, so I'll, once it's done the download, I'll, I'll go through the next step with you guys. Okay, guys, and once it gets here, you just click on restart. And then let it do it. I just come up with this. You're about to be logged off. That's fine. Click on close. And then the computer will restart and continue doing its installation. So, yeah, once it, gets, once it restarts, it's going to say working on updates. Let it do its thing. It's going to install Windows and do the updates and stuff for Windows 10. So, just let it sit there. It'll be about a half hour, 45 minutes or so. Alright, guys. So, pretty much, you let it do its thing. Uh, do everything automatically. Then I'll take you to this screen. From here, it's pretty self-explanatory. Just follow what it tells you here, like next. Usually here, I usually turn off everything. You can leave it on, but I don't like to. And you can use Cortana or not, it's up to you. Next. Now just loading it, getting ready guys, it's getting ready man. There's a lot of updates and stuff, but you know what, hopefully while you do this you're doing other things. If you sit here waiting for it, will be forever. You weren't kidding, this part does take a while, so this might take several minutes. It takes another 10 minutes or so at least. Alright, then it's going to get you to this window, uh, you can learn about your browser, the store, or learn more, obviously we're not doing that, but that's it, thank you for updating Windows, and they don't lose any of your files or anything like that, which is nice, uh, but it's always good to have a backup in case if something gets corrupt or something in the process, but there you go, now we have Windows 10, and it, it will be the one that you, like if you have Windows 7 Pro, it will be Windows 10 Pro, if you have Windows 7 home, it'll be uh, Windows 10 home. Like, I'll show you here. So, I have Windows 10 home, and it's a legit copy now. Windows is activated, the IMEI is in the, in the board, right? So, like, if just say you would change your hard drive and install Windows 10 home, uh, it would automatically, usually, it automatically activate if you have the proper Windows. That's it, guys. All set. Um, like and subscribe, we'll see you in the next one and I hope this helps somebody. I'll leave the description the, the link below and I'll take it'll be very simple, anybody can figure it out. Alright, thanks, see you in the next one.